Hello friends, it's me. You know what we're doing today. We're going Karen hunting. These two Karens fighting over the last Thanksgiving turkey. This is my cart. This is my cart. You can't take my cart. What are you doing, dude? It's my What are you doing, dude? You can't take the last turkey. Personally, I would also throw ham for the last Thanksgiving turkey. I'd do whatever it takes. I don't blame him. This guy ordered food at a restaurant, ate almost all of it, and sent it back to the kitchen asking for a refund. So she telling me I got to pay for that? I mean, let me ask the audience. <laughs> I mean, I'm not trying to be rude it's or okay. anything, no, sir, yeah, but no, no, you, being you mean ate the me. whole You're entire being thing. Mean. You're being mean. You being mean because you won't give me a refund on the food I already ate. You can't eat all the food and be like, eh, I hated every bite of it. Can you remake it or at least give me back my money? Are you stupid? It's like getting surgery. Tell the doctor, oh, it doesn't look the way that it used to. Refund my hospital bills. Karen versus McLaren. She's like, your car is too loud. Stands behind it to take a picture of the license plate. Wait, this Everyone's life. Ellie? Yes, it. How to piss off a Karen. And they go keep doing it. Oh, she's had enough. Just go home. Just go home, Karen. You've lost this one. To him. <laughs> Your car might be loud, but I'm louder. It's right in his ear. Car go burr. Karen go. <laughs> These two Karens got into a fight right after they got their drinks from Starbucks. So angry that they both launched their drinks at each other. They was mad because they didn't have their coffee. Y'all just got the coffee. And they literally launched it at each other before they could put the straw in. Boom. Double homicide. They both got each other good. That was a nice body shot. <laughs> Rest in pieces to that latte. This Karen is angry because this guy parked normally within the lines next to her, but she parked over the line. And she's telling him to move his truck like he did something wrong. Move your truck. Move your truck. Oh. You think it's funny? It's funny? Oh. Yeah. Is that funny? How are you just gonna sit there and take that? How are you not gonna rear end her right then and there? I would've threw something back. You know, sometimes I wish I had one of those nasty slushies whenever somebody pisses me off, I can just chuck it at them. It's a good thing to have. Is she stupid? Oh my God, she's actually stupid. There's empty space behind you. Literally reverse out of your car. Or you can pull up. You got it through the passenger seat just fine. What is she mad about? Oh, now she gonna trap him. So he can't just pull out in front of you? Oh, no, she got the front too. <gasps> hey, you can't do that. You can't do that. He didn't even touch you or your car. And she's just gonna. You wanna move your truck? Move your truck. You can't move the truck now, you good. Okay. Why are you filming? Uh, I was like, is her boyfriend filming or something? What do you mean? Why are you filming? You literally caused damage to this guy's truck. You literally threw a drink, slammed a cart into his car. Ma'am, I'm getting my evidence. I see you in court. All the damages they got you on camera for now, you're gonna have to pay for later. We gonna watch this again because this is one of my favorite Karens of all time. She missed the bus, runs out in front of it, and then just... Oh my God. Breaks the window with her fist. No, oh you did that. God. Now you're no, going to jail. I to get off the bus. Hi. Open the door. I got some place to be. You couldn't have waited for the other bus? No? Oh, she's going to run away. <laughs> when she realizes what she's done. Like, oh, I could have just waited for the other bus. I didn't have to break the window. On second thought, I will just walk. Bye. We're not actually holding anything. And then a Prius pulls up. Of course they're going to be confused. <laughs> they don't have anything. They put it down. Thank you. They weren't even holding anything to begin with. Put down your bridge of nothingness so that I may cross. Yes, ma'am. You hear that Prius go? She used all 30 horsepower for that. You better delete that now. I can't order 63 burritos. You're not gonna order 63 burritos. <laughs> it's not
You said your account was in the negatives. You are broke, yeah. Michael. <laughs> Imagine McDonald's calling you out. You walked in here saying your bank account was negative. So no, sir, you can't order 63 burritos. Also, why does it let you order 63 burritos? Should there be a limit on burritos? This guy was recording a video in the store. Um, hey, Karen. I speak English now, and I was wondering oh, if... Oh, yeah, you speak English now, huh? Yeah, can you just tell me what was going on, the situation? Wow, he is so smart. In a few minutes, learn the entire English language just so he can hear Karen's complaint. But was it worth it? Because I couldn't speak English before, but now that I understand it and I can speak it fluently... Um, you can speak it good. fluently all together, and you shouldn't be in the store right now. You can't huh? just take pictures and videos of random women. That's against the law. You can go to jail for that. You know that, oh, right? Oh, nah. I have my own consent. Uh, smile. Have I committed a crime? It's rude to take photos of people without their permission. But is it illegal? No. You only need one person's consent. I have my own consent. You didn't have her consent? She's pissed. If she pressed charges, you can be in jail. How do you not understand that? Anyway, it's against the law. You can't take uh, pictures of people. I don't think so. I think it's good. Girl, you gotta open up the handbook. I don't see no rule that says you can't take pictures of people. I think it's okay. If she wanted to press charges, if she knew your name, she could. Why would I give her my name if she wanted to press charges? <laughs> Why would you take pictures of a random person when you don't have her permission? Well, actually, it was a video. A video? Yeah. You can't take video of people if you don't have their permission. It's against the law. I thought you said pictures. Yeah, bro, you said pictures first. I was taking a video. Oh, well, that. That changes everything. Even worse, straight to jail. Times how many frames per second was in that video. Also, this woman literally works at the store. Can't you kick him out? Especially if it's against the law. Vegan lady? No again. Guys, I caught the vegan lady eating a cheeseburger. No, I'm not. It's right in your hand. Give me that phone. She got caught at the Mickey D's. Vegan lady? That is vegan teacher no, to again. you. Guys, I caught the vegan lady eating a cheeseburger. No, I'm not. It's right in your hand. Give me that phone. It was quite convincing. We got the wrong vegetable, Karen. Mission failed. We'll get him next time. This customer, Karen, started going insane because they wouldn't accept her expired coupon. You bitch, you just said you gonna punch me in my mouth. No, because come you punch me. Come do it then. Come do it then. You just threatened me. I'm doing my job. You just threatened me. I'm doing my job. Uh, and part of my job is I punch customers who insist I use their expired coupon. Y'all really fighting over a piece of paper. No, no, no. Don't punch me in my face. Don't punch me in the counter. You see my kid just say you gonna punch me in my face. She gonna act like this in front of her child? Her kid is just like, uh, I don't know this person. Mother, can I borrow your phone right now? I'm gonna call CPS myself. So embarrassing. Come get you some. You don't want it, I promise you. All right, get out. You have got to go. You can't be in here. I'm calling the police because she got me. Do need to leave. They're not gonna take your coupon. Do you still want to buy the sweater or not? You already made a fool out of yourself. Just leave. When you get seated next to a Karen and she's overly dramatic about your loud music. Okay, well this is very annoying because I can see myself as being that Karen. I cannot stand when I'm sitting next to somebody and I can hear their garbage music. It's one thing if you're listening to good music, but like a huge pet peeve that I have is I can't stand being forced to listen to music I don't like. Whether it's in an Uber, in a store, through somebody's headphones. The whole point of headphones is so you can listen to your music without other people hearing it. Unless you're listening to some Nine Inch Nails, Slipknot, Avenged Sevenfold, I don't want to hear it. A wild boomer appears who refuses to wear a mask so they don't let him back into the Walmart. And he gets up into their face like And bro, you have no authority over me! Quit spitting all over people! Huh? Quit spitting all over people! Do you need my ID? No, I don't. I need You're to... trying to make witness that I'm wrong? No, if you touch me, I have proof! No, you threatened to hit me. I all have proof, not because, me! Damn, because you're you. trying to fight everybody in the damn yes. store! Now fight involves contact, doesn't it? I'm trying to fight you with my hot breath. I don't gotta use my fist. When he got the power of spit spewing, 50 miles per hour. That's a bit excessive. Like, they're just asking you to wear a mask, bro. Y'all gonna let me into this Walmart or nah? You hit my car. Where? On my bumper. Uh-uh. Yeah, right there. No. You just admitted it. You said you were sorry. You didn't mean to. I said I'm sorry. I was riding your ass. You said you no. Okay. Oh no, she's called her husband. Better run, better get out of there. I don't see any damage on this car, bro. Do you? But he's recording me right now. And I I'm recording you because I told, I let me talk to your husband. Him, so. I don't oh, need permission. Okay. We're in public. Okay. I never, I usually don't do this, okay. but you're being funny. <laughs> I do like no, your that's, glasses. That's fine. I like your glasses. Can we trade glasses? I like yours better. Oh yeah, he's, yeah, he's, yeah. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm unbelievable, huh? She ain't even mad about it anymore. A Kia Soul? That car was ruined when you bought it. What are you complaining about? So they set up this little proposal at the beach. They got candles, rose petals, it says marry me, and a wild Karen appears and is like, no, no, you can't do this. Conversation right now because I'm in the middle of something, but thank you for your concern, I appreciate it. Ma'am, we are not gonna stop this event for this conversation, so please walk oh, away. Wow. I am angry, bitter, and divorced. If I can't have a nice proposal, nobody can. I'm here to stop this. She's just chilling at her office. I spot a Karen staring at me like I owe her money. She's looking directly in the camera. Why the long face? She's probably cold and wants your jacket. Freaking Karen of a neighbor pretends to water her tree just to make mud in my yard. <laughs> this is petty with a capital P. She's not even watering her tree. The hose is pointed at the neighbor's fence. They were playing music past 8 p.m. Goes on Reddit. What can I do to ruin my neighbor's day? Make mud in their backyard. I mean, he's clearly upset about it, so it worked. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button in the face. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click. And comment below, let me know which one of these was the worst, Karen. And make sure you subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.